Lobitos, who just came back from England and then uh, started a band because we had a lot of jazz influence. Don't forget that we read classic in the university, majoring in keyboards and uh, the horns. So those are his major influence in life. So classic was part of him. So he started with classical jazz, turned high life into jazz. Do you understand? In 70. The Nigerian 70 didn't last more than a year. You now realize that. In my band, in my house at Kalakuta, there are a lot of people who are not Nigerians. They are Ghanaians, they are Syrian, and then so that turned into Africa 70. So then he was just playing music to dance, music for everybody to listen to. Music that was, for me, that was music of fella, that was Afrobeat. Afrobeat now went from Afrobeat to the time when fella started getting confrontation from government, became serious protest music. Government started going to flogging, government started going to ambush and shooting. So it became very confrontational. As soon as it became very confrontational, the music moved from, for me, the ordinary Afrobeat to the music of fella. Why I call the music of like the music that only him could play. Only him could go to the studio and say, Obasan Joy they there with a big fast stomach when the man was in government. Only him could go to the studio and say, Abiola International, Tif, ITT. So it became music of fella, it became very exclusive to him because they are pushed him to the wall. They are pushed him to the extent that he could do anything with his sound. And don't forget that one of his basic principles in life was that he said music was a weapon. He didn't still see music for dancing's sake. For him, it was a weapon to fight whatever people needed to fight. How long have you been? Have you been? I've known fellow all my life. <laughs> all my life. Since I was a kid in King's College, used to join friends to go watch fella. I was in the University of Lagos, already mass come. I lived with fella for like a year and a half, you know from campus to Kalakuta, back to campus like that for like a year and a half until he died and then yes, I've been doing stuff and then... No, he, he, had done, what, he only strengthened him, not radicalized, he strengthened him, he emboldened him. They made him now know that you have done your worst, the next is to kill. 
the bond my husband done everything. So he, stre he strengthened them. He became totally free. He became, he could do anything. Mm. Who did he represent? He represents, for me, he represents the, the most ideal fighter. Because she too fought to prevent wrestling.